Mike Poland, who is studying the Yellowstone volcano, was able to determine the approximate date of the next eruption. Since the eruption of Yellowstone can lead to catastrophic consequences, the U.S. Geological Survey is closely monitoring the supervolcano. Over the past years, there have been more and more allegations that the eruption should have occurred a long time ago. Poland said that the eruption was not really ripe yet. There are two reasons for this. The first reason is that volcanoes cannot erupt on a specific schedule. An eruption will require a certain amount of magma and the required pressure indicator which would allow the magma to rise to the surface of the earth. He also added that today the volcano may even be in decline because the magma chamber underneath is molten by no more than 15%. Also, there is not enough pressure to trigger an eruption. The second reason is that the calculations of the intervals through which the eruptions took place in fact may turn out to be incorrect because no one has carried out a second test or created new models of such a catastrophic situation. According to Poland, if an eruption happens, it will not earlier than in 100,000 years.